Hey guys, Daniel here. Welcome to another Super Smash Bros. Uh, Fusion episode. For the people who don't know, in this series I randomly uh, generate two Smash Bros. characters and for of the two characters I have to make one character. So imagine if I generate Pichu and Ganondorf and I have to make a fusion of the two characters in one. I hope it's an easy one. Let's see. Alright, here we go once again. Oh, please be an easy one. Ugh. Link, all right, that's doable. And the second one, Bowser. I have to make a combination of Link and Bowser. All right, let's do this. So this time I have to make a fusion of Bowser and Link. This was definitely more challenging than the Duck on Dark and Joker last time. It's like, what for a body should I choose? Link's human body or Bowser's reptile body? In my first attempt to this, I uh, gave Link Bowser's body <laughs> and let me say it looked pretty uh, horrific. And as you can see now, in the end I decided to use Link's body for the fusion. So I will basically make an evil Link with a lot of spikes and horns. At the beginning I wanted to make the character in his underwear, like Link does at the beginning of Breath of the Wild, <laughs> because Bowser's also naked, but at the end I decided against it. So I will be giving the character Link's champion outfit. But I will Bowserify it. That's by the way always a big challenge for me, to give the character enough traits from both characters. So I don't want to make a character that's like 80% Link and 20% Bowser, I wanted to make it 50-50. And at this point you can see a lot of Link, because yeah the character looks more like Link than Bowser at the moment, but trust me that will change. And of course I had to give the character uh, Link's Master Sword, I mean that makes sense right? Alright we are done with sketching, so now we can trace and adjust the character. As you can see, I gave the character Link's face, but he has Bowser's horns and Bowser's big eyebrows. Those eyebrows really help to give the character more of a Bowser look. He gets an evil smile with pointy teeth. And next up is the outfit. I gave the character the big uh, spiky uh, chains that Bowser has. And for the champion outfit, I gave it a more worn out and a barbaric look. We can't make the outfit too nice, it's still Bowser after all. And for Link's boots, I kept them the same, they didn't really need a change. I could have made him barefoot, but we already have corn for that part of the fandom. <laughs> so at this point I'm almost done with tracing. The only thing that's left is the master sword. Oh yeah, I gave Link uh, Bowser's pointy nails, because again, that really fits with the horns and the spikes theme that I'm going for. Now I only need to adjust some things and give it some color, so let's go to the final results. Alright, that was my fusion of Link and Bowser. I hope that you guys uh, enjoyed this video. And if you want to see more of this series, please give this video a like. Bye, see you next time.